Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to pixelate your art in Abyss Paint X. This only works layer by layer, but if you want, you could merge all the layers or maybe even make a duplicate drawing and merge all the layers there and then pixelate it. But I'll be showing you how to do it layer by layer here. So really have whatever drawing you want. I just did a bad little doodle here and we'll be showing you how to pixelate it. Of course, you can use whatever layer you want. You could pixelate any part of the drawing, but I'll just be using this mock of a sketch for an example. You're going to want to go right over here into the filter section. There's two different ways to pixelate stuff. You can either use the actual pixelate section or one thing in the blur section and both work pretty well. First, we'll be looking at the blur section. You're going to want to click on mosaic and then just change how much you want it to be pixelated. This can be a lot or a little depending on genuinely how much you want and you can just do it to whatever sort of level you desire. Then if we went to the actual pixelate section, there are a bunch of different types of pixelating. We're going to go to square pixelate first because that is honestly the most common one. And you will see here it is much more solid than the mosaic blur. With angle, you can change what sort of angle you want the pixels on, or you can just leave them at zero to make it just normal. With radius is essentially how pixelated you want it to be. This is one pixel, and then two, and three, and four, and you can see it rapidly changing to becoming a much less clear picture. Of course, there's other ways to pixelate things. You have crystallize, hexagonal, triangular, pointillize, dots, and dots square. So as you can see, all these options are pretty interesting and would actually probably make your lineup pretty neat. If you want to get into pixel art, you might want to look at this sort of stuff and then end up coloring it in. I personally don't do pixel art, so I would not be able to give the best advice on that, but that seems like a pretty solid way to go. Again, just choose what the level of pixelation you want is, and then when you're satisfied, click the tick. And you can see it has been pixelized. I'm going to do some examples of bigger brushes and smaller brushes with this. So here I grabbed a few different types. I have a couple different sizes and then the airbrush and we're going to see what the pixelization, the square pixelization looks like with those. With some of them, because it was really thin, you can see it's just sort of disappeared. It made a really nice effect to the airbrush though and it just looks so sort of normal for the other ones. That was how to pixelate your drawings in Abyss Paint. I hope that you found this helpful and if you did, maybe consider supporting. Bye!